Hi, I'm Annika Svenska and I'm ambassador to Wet Nose Animal Aid. I'm here today at Folly Wildlife Rescue Hospital in Tunbridge Wells, which is an amazing rescue. They take in all sorts of animals. They take in hedgehogs, they take in birds, they take in everything that you'll find in the natural habitat around their home countries. We've got Sussex, Surrey and Kent, and basically pretty much any animal that can be driven to them. They're a fantastic rescue. I've been supporting them for ages and rescues like this really do need donations and help to keep going. I've got a wonderful little character with me here today, this fantastic little hedgehog, and he has decided to come out for once and say hi, because I don't really have a lot of luck with hedgehogs. They always seem to curl up in a big ball and stick their spikes out. His story is that he came out of hibernation and he wasn't doing very well. It was, he looked a little bit undernourished. He looked like he hadn't been getting enough food. And if you see a hedgehog out in the day, like this little guy, that usually means that something's wrong. And if you do see him, it's probably best to, to pick up one that you see out and take it to your wildlife rescue to check over and make sure that everything is fine. He had some ticks on his body as well, which is not a good sign. It's always good to have those taken off. Well, he spent some time here now at Folly and he's back to full health. As you can see, he's fantastic. He's well fed and he's all nice and shiny and he'll go back to where he was found. It's always important to make sure that wildlife always returns to the wild and we don't have the temptation to try and keep any of the animals that we help. Now, Wet Nose Animal Aid is a fantastic charity. It was set up originally by Andrea and Gavin in order to help small animal rescues all over the UK and all over the world. The idea is to help those rescues that have problems in raising money themselves because they're simply just too small. They might be starting out, they could be in someone's back garden. And when you're too small, you have problems like you can't get a, a lottery grant and things like that. So this is where Wet Nose comes in. They're fantastic, they raise money and they distribute it to all of these small rescues that really, really need help. And so on that note, <laughs> I'll try and get a nose on with this hedgehog in my arms, but this year, make sure you pose with a nose for Wet Nose Day this September. What can you do for Wet Nose Day? Well, you can support your local rescues in your area. You can hold an event yourself, or you can simply go down and support one of the fundraising events they're doing, or go online and buy one of these noses. And every single penny will be put in the pot to be distributed out to all of those rescues that really do need our help. So remember, pose with a nose. And that's bye from me, and bye from him. Bye-bye. <laughs>